oh gosh, if you haven't seen part number one, make sure you go check it out. I give a bit of pretext context to uh, what are we doing right now, but today we're opening part number two of the greatest or rarest boost packs that I can find on eBay. So these are basically the, uh, the second lot right now. And holy smokes, let me just focus this one up. This is going to be a ripper. We've got another Neo Destiny boost pack to open. One of the rare card sets. Call of Legends, the most random set ever. But you can already see how epic it's going to be with Groudon on the front. Base set Jungle as well. And EX Hidden Legends. I reckon we're going to start with this bad boy. See what we can pull. This, I don't know, the artwork on this front thing looks amazing, doesn't it? Ready still? He's in like sort of the, uh, it's like raining in the background. Find your hidden adventure. Bum, bum, bum. Made, uh, if this is when it was made by Nintendo, I'm pretty sure. Dude, this is just nuts. I love, like, the silver vibe as well. Only nine game cards because that's what they did in the old, uh, EX sort of day. But, let's just crack this one open and see what we can manage to get. As I said, I don't really know too much about the set. Other than, uh, yeah. It's got incredible artwork. It's part of the EX series. Dude, Rhyhorn. But let's get into it. Take down with 50 right there. Wizma, oh my gosh, what is he doing? He's like, oh, my poor sandcastle got knocked down the beach for the 50th time. Chikorita as well. Man, EX cards are so sick. Poison powder. Oh, Spiel, that's epic. They've all got a nice, like, glaze sort of hand-drawn texture as well. I really do like it. Whoa, that's an epic Vulpix. That is a sick-looking Vulpix, eh? Clouds in the background and everything. Oh, oh, yes, look at this. The reverses. They're the best part of EX cards, honestly. Like, look at that. It's all like uh, energies in the background. Oh my, Meta Charm Reverse. And then what's next? Regular Rare Huntail. Holy mother flipper. Do you remember Huntail? Like, I used to, oh, I used to go so hard with him uh, back in the uh, games. Then we got Glalie. Glalie's another really epic Pokemon. And then Matang. Hidden Legends, man, that's such a sick set. Like, oh my gosh. Alright, put that one to the side. Not a bad start. I love Hidden Legends. Okay, here we go. The Jungle Boost Pack. 11 additional game cards. The base set of the base set. And uh, let's keep let's keep it rocking. Out of Jungle once again. Before they even knew what EXs were. So if we get a Holy Card, I'd be fine. We're going to get two from the back, so that's usually a bit safe. And open this one up. The cards are so thick. It's ridiculous. Paraset. Oh, Rapidash, you epic boy. Oh, he's so epic. Radadash, Man Radadash, Rapidash, and then Mankey. Nidoran. Venonat, looking looking like an absolute insect right there. Then we've got Goldeen. A Pikachu, that's a really good pull. Like, oh, base set Pikachu, amazing. Got that Eevee card right here. The rare's probably coming up any second as well. Spiro, gosh, that's such a basic one. That's nostalgia in a nutshell. I don't know about you guys, but oh my gosh. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Regular rare Clefable. Then they are uh, Gloom Definit. Glo I remember that. Gloom, he was everywhere. I think I found one of those in the street once. Clefable. Don't know what, like some sort of uh, metronome or minimize. There's his two attacks. Maybe he's doing a bit of metronome. Oh, dude, they it's so hand drawn, it's ridiculous. Like Bob Ross painted this background. This is literally what it looks like. And the sets were so small, 64 cards in an entire set. Okay, put that one to the side, crazy stuff. Now we'll go bit, jump bit back into the uh, future with a call of flipping legends. Now, back when I first started YouTube, these boost boxes actually weren't too expensive, so I opened one on the channel. So if you want to watch a whole boost box of this, if you uh, see me open it right now and go like, damn, that's a pretty cool set. I've got a whole boost box opening, go check it out. If I remember, I'll link it in the description. But... Some of the most, like, it's in between the Heart Gold, Soul, Silver, and the Platinum, or like, it's something like that, isn't it? We really weird placement. Totodile? Like, look at this. This is the tallest bit of artwork I've ever seen. Like, usually pictures aren't this big, are they? It's so weird how Pokemon cards have changed over time. That's why I love doing stuff like this. Magma? Or oh, Houndor? Looks like a Hound Doom is so epic. Okay, we're on the reverse, EV reverse right there. These pictures are huge! It's like watching on a big giant uh, plasma screen. <gasps> Regular rare for Relegator! Gosh, that is awesome. Look at the shading all across there. Absolutely incredible. Spinning tail and surf with 80. 
metal energy as well. It's a really cool energy. I don't know why. Jewel, it's like, a, it's like, you know, the pirates when they write letters and they used to have like sort of, I don't know, like alcohol spilt on the paper. It's kind of what it looks like, doesn't it? Jewel Ball and Lost World. This set was so random, but it's really, really cool. I love the tinted sort of background. It's definitely one of those older, it's like gone for the older vibe of the set. I get around that. That was pretty cool. Now, holy smokes. Our last Neo Destiny, guys. We opened one yesterday and this is our last one today. I, okay, I know, I know everyone's saying, preserve it for the culture rando. If everyone keeps opening it, there'll never be one left, but I just, I think we got to do it. It's for a YouTube video, guys. This, don't worry. I'm literally doing it so we can all view this down the future. Like, when there's none left, we can be like, oh yeah, that, that's what it looked like to open one. I'm just so blessed that I actually get to. I know, I do count my lucky stars every day. Put that to the side. Not doing the card trick, guys. 11 ca game cards. Gligar. Oh my gosh, that Sun Kern is awesome. Totodile? Venonat? Oh my gosh, that's freaking awesome. That's sick, that's sick. Oh, dude, this set is ridiculous. Why didn't they make cards like this anymore? Seal? Porygon? And it's 105 cards. Whoa! I bet this is some sort of, like, semi-rare card. Unknown. Is that an unknown S? Unknown S or a 5? Here's our rare, here's our rare, here's our rare. Please be a hollow. Damn, that's alright, that's alright. Dark Ursa Ring. Oh my gosh, Battle Frenzy. What an epic dude. He's over with the uh, the moon in the background. Oh, yo, Dark Executor. Look at that. That's an epic card, guys. That is an epic card. And then what do we got? Dark Fortress. That's a creepy card, I gotta say. Like, his eyes are really just beady up. <gasps> Light slow, bro. Could you imagine opening a booster box of this? I'd probably pass out and die. I'm going to be honest, I'd be on the floor just having a seizure the whole time. Oh my gosh, this artwork is too much. But with that, fellas, that wraps part number two up. And fellas, stay tuned for part number three, because we have like three boosters, but they're all bangers. Like, look at this. Unseen Forces. The most EX has ever made, and the coolest set ever, which was taken off the shelves early because it was too good. Not even kidding. Legend Maker EX, another EX series that's absolutely ridiculous. And we're opening an E series Aquapolis sealed booster pack in mint condition. I'm not playing around. We're literally opening all three. I don't care. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a video. Click the annotation sidebar, link in description. I know where I put it on the channel. Find it. I'll see you in part number three, guys. But until then, you gotta keep on gaming. Alright, guys, next opening. I'm so excited. I'll see you then. <laughs> Now, what's your vision?